Good morning, Valley. Today on Valley Puerto Vida, we've got a lot in store for you. Our team is out fighting hunger and feeding hope with our friends at Food Bank RGV. We're also checking in with our friends at Vida to see how education can help transform the lives of so many people right here in the Valley. Plus, we're dropping by South Padre Island for a sneak peek at a man-made reef that'll be made by sinking a boat out on the water. You're not going to want to go anywhere. Valley Puerto Vida starts right now. Hi there, and thanks again for joining us. I'm your host, Danielle Bonda. Well, the Food Bank RGV is proudly affiliated with Feeding America and Feeding Texas. They've got a lot going on all year long, so we decided to drop by and catch all the action. Hi everyone, it's Stuart Hanif, CEO of your Food Bank RGV. And we are here live on the front lines, like we always are, at our drive through emergency pantry. Behind us, up to 700 families are going to receive emergency food assistance today with commodities and nutritious, healthy meals so that not only do they go to bed tonight not hungry, but they can wake up tomorrow and start to become healthier. You know, one in four children were going to bed hungry here in the Rio Grande Valley. That's one too many. One in two in our rural area. Now, the need and the demand for emergency food assistance has grown ninefold. We're actually feeding more than twice as many people as normal. Typically, in normal times, we provide food for 64,000 families, individuals, seniors, and veterans every week. That number now has surged to 141,000. But we've been here for 35 years. This is actually the start of our 35th anniversary. And during those more than three decades, we've seen our share of disasters and crises. The thing about our food bank is we're resilient, we're strong, and we have heart. And those three things will ensure that no matter what comes next, we will be better and stronger than ever. appreciate your support for those 35 years and you can continue to help ensure that families don't have to go to bed hungry. Be safe and remember, you're not alone, we're in this together and we will get through this together. God bless and stay safe. Bank RGV continues with a commitment to improving lives through food assistance here in the Valley. To lend a hand, you can donate or volunteer. Well, Valley Initiative for Development and Advancement has been impacting sustainable economic growth one vida at a time. Here's Dr. Shirley Reed of South Texas College with more. Vida and Valley Interface and South Texas Community College, we all kind of came about in early 1995. We have a partnership with them whereby they identify students who wish to go to college but are not really financially prepared to do so. And they assist the student by paying the student's tuition and providing all these case management support services. Vita couldn't do it alone. We couldn't do it alone. We have learned all it takes is a car breaking down, a grandmother getting sick, someone get pregnant, and the student will drop out of college and more than likely never come back and earn a college degree. That's what has been so critical about Vida. 
to be there whatever life challenges come forward, VITA is there to support that student and help them graduate. I see the vulnerability of students because of their economic challenges that they simply must have the financial support, the emotional support, and the social support that VITA provides them. I would say VITA is pivotal. I say it's critical. I say it's life-changing. I see the positive impact every day from the work of VITA and the basic principle of case management, being somebody who cares, who's there, and supports you. That's what leads to success. I wish the community understood the contributions of both VITA and South Texas College to the economic prosperity and well-being of this community. We both seem to be a bit of a secret. We truly are making a difference in creating the middle class, improving the quality of life, helping families earn a living wage and to be able to provide for themselves and their family. And it's done in partnership. Neither one of us can do it alone and neither one of us could do it without the many, many other partners that support both VITA and South Texas College. South Texas College was created to help families get out of poverty. And you get out of poverty by getting a job. And you get a job by having a skill set. So VITA has been critical to bringing students to our front door so we could provide them the skill set so they can earn, um, have a meaningful career, earn a living, and have a good life. VITA will continue working for the RGV by addressing employers' needs for skilled workers. Feel free to log on to VITAcareers.org for more information. Well, many of us look for ways to keep ourselves, our families, and our businesses safe. And one way to do that is by taking preventative measures. Our team stopped by RGV Fire Safety in Santa Rosa for more on what we can do. Check it out. My name is Hernando Gonzalez Jr. Uh, we are at RGV Fire Safety Security. During this time, uh, there's a lot of issues with uh, heaters. Uh, fire, firefighters always tell us that uh, number one causes of fires are heaters, portable heaters. So um, early detection, make sure that you have a, a system that actually reports to our central station, gets that information to our local fire department and police departments to get um, help immediately, smoke detectors, CO2 detectors, and things like that. So a lot of the, the security systems now are, are on your phone. Um, you can actually see when your packages are at home and, and people that are trying to steal them, you can actually see all of that information on, on your phones as well. Um, a lot of the times, Surveillance is a little bit more out, uh, overlooked and people just want security, but surveillance is a lot more uh, comes into place because it's more not just to see who stole that package, but in case there's an incident, uh, whether it's at your business or at your property, uh, you want to be able to have video evidence to prove uh, that you did your due diligence to uh, help eliminate or prevent that incident. Well, in, in homes, it's really important to remember to uh, change your batteries once a year in October, usually that's when uh, that happens and they advocated that a lot. But uh, regular testing of your systems, make, make sure that, that every single window and door is being tested. We've encountered many uh, competitors that fail to properly secure or cover a window or a door and that leaves our customers or their customers uh, vulnerable. And with us, we try to make sure that every single uh, entrance, entry point is protected from anybody entering uh, yeah, un unlawfully. Keeping your fire extinguishers up to date with regular inspections is one thing that you need to do uh, to make sure that you have something that's going to work. Um, there's a lot of times that people don't have it checked and when they need it, it's not going to work. So we have different extinguishers for vehicles, for kitchen, 
for homes. Uh, we have combustibles, all kinds of different uh, things that we have uh, to protect you. In households, it's very important to plan ahead. Always plan a, uh, um, a plan of egress a meeting point outside the home. Uh, it's very important to do that with uh, younger children because in case of a fire, you need to be able to get out and go to that meeting point and make sure that everybody is accounted for. Um, if you have a security system, the security system alone will detect, if you have smoke detectors, it will detect that smoke, that fire, and report it to our uh, central station, which will turn in turn, you know, roll the fire department out to you. But getting everybody out is our primary goal. So we're here for the community. Uh, anybody that has any questions, uh, can feel free to give us a call, RGV Fire Safety Security. 24 hour service and monitoring can really help make all the difference. So feel free to check out the website on your screen to learn more. All right, well now it's time to hit South Padre Island for a special outdoor sailing adventure. While on the boat, you can actually enjoy lunch and dinner uh, being cooked as you sail into the sunset. And you may even catch a glimpse of dolphins swimming nearby. Take a look. Hi, my name is Leti. Uh, right now we are uh, in the dock of Tequila Sunset Bar where is Dock Commotion Sailing Adventure. We proudly own and operate our boat. Um, I am the first mate, my husband is the captain. Uh, it's a vessel with a capacity for 34 people. Right now for the circumstance we are putting no more than 20, sometimes less if we have a lot of couples. When you come to the boat, you enjoy a two hours uh, cruise with the sunset, with of course in the sunset time, with dinner, three course dinner. We have the chef cooking for you in the boat. It's very nice, but it's very casual. We are very uh, proud of Commotion. They are, it's, uh, even when it's a very big boat, it's the only one able to take you to sail all over the bay. Uh, the bay is very, very uh, shadow. We sail with uh, two, three feet of water. So uh, it's a very calm experience. Um, you don't have nothing to be worried. We uh, really make sure to you can have distance between uh, each other. We are very careful with the food. We take all the precautions. So when you are uh, sailing in commotion in the Laguna Madre, uh, First, you don't have to worry about waves or splashing. It's very calm in the bay. We don't have uh, nothing of that. So you just can sail a smoothie uh, and uh, yeah, enjoy a very smooth ride. It's almost like being a car, very, very slow. It's very easy to, to stand up and move around in the boat. We definitely uh, family friendly. So we have uh, families, we have a lot of couples, can be very romantic too. Uh, right now, when we're in such a low capacity, it's very easy to really have like your own space, your own party. Uh, it's such a smooth ride, even when kids come, they just relax and enjoy of, you know, the camp waters and look for uh, turtles or whatever they can see. So, family friendly. Well, we, uh, for the low season, we are sailing Wednesdays uh, through Saturday. Uh, but you really can check up what is going on with the boat on uh, commotionsailingadventure.com or you always can call us to 956-410-9945. Uh, uh, we, we move the times of the sailing, the sunset dinner, because the sunset change time. So right now we are 6 uh, till 8 p.m. It's a two hours cruise. but. Uh, with the weeks passing, we're going to start to be a little more early because, of course, we want you to catch the sunset. We will be happy to take care of you, your family, your couple. Come and join us. If you'd like to book your adventure or sunset dinner cruise by the Lower Laguna Madre and beautiful Gulf of Mexico, head on over to the island or check out their website. Well, it's time now for a look at your local weather updates, but stay tuned because Valley Por Vida is still hanging out at the island and we'll be back with details on a boat sinking mission uh, that you won't want to miss. That info and more coming up.